Hey everyone and thanks for tuning in to today's dev update. Uh, today I'm just going to be showing you the uh, first integrations of Firefighter AI and sort of the basic idea of how we want it to work. So you're able to select individual firefighters and multi-select and give them uh, commands such as go to your truck, exit your truck, grab your equipment that you're assigned to, etc. Um, this is all stuff I want to elaborate on when the update is released. For now, I've decided to not work too much on the firefighter AI as it's a really complex and uh, expansive game mechanic. So to, to really want to do it right before a release uh, would really delay things and I want to make sure you guys have all of this new stuff before then. So I'm, I've decided to uh, just try to finish up the update and get it out as soon as possible to you guys. And then once that's out, then put my efforts into really expanding the firefighter AI. So you can see here, I can quickly select my vehicle, empty it, get my area ladder set up, and decide what I want to do with my firefighters. Um, commands like uh, quick equipped are, are planned, where as soon as your firefighters get off the rig, they'll go and get their corresponding items to what role they are on the rig. And uh, rapid deploy for the engine company, where they can get a line stretched and hooked up to a water supply with one click. So these are things that are possible with this system, as well as seamlessly switching between controlling a firefighter uh, character and then releasing him back to the AI once you're no longer in control of him. All this is toggleable, meaning you can decide if you want your unit to spawn with AI firefighters or if you want it to spawn with no firefighters. So you can get them all back into their company with one click of a button, they'll return to the rig. Um, in this clip, I'm showing how quick you can change between firefighters and a company just with one button. So I'm switching between the different uh, members. And here's our promised preview of the new engine 7 8 and ladder 5 7 2020 models. Another thing that we're really wanting to work on, uh, most likely tomorrow, is the traffic AI and give them more options of how to react to the vehicle, whether it's pull to the right, pull to the left, continue driving forward, uh, speed up, things like that. And that's all depending on their surroundings so right now they react in one way and if they hit something they're programmed to disappear it, that really kills the immersion so um, now that I've gotten some practice with AI I'm gonna really improve the traffic to uh, react more realistically thanks for tuning in to today's dev update and uh, I'll see you next time